Good evening. The University of New Mexico and New Mexico State University's men's basketball teams will not be facing off this season. The decision comes after a shooting on UNM's campus this weekend that left one dead and another injured. News 13's Alexis Koneski is live outside the pit with what's behind the decision. Yeah, that's right. No rivalry game this year. Officials say it was a joint decision between the two schools, and they also added that there's been problems at Lobo Aggies games long before this weekend shooting. The pit was supposed to look like this on Saturday for the big rivalry basketball game between the Lobos and Aggies. But that almost sold out game is now canceled after a shooting on campus involving at least three UNM students and an NMSU men's basketball player. It left one dead and another injured. We felt at this time there still there needed to be a pause. This event just recently occurred. Um, there's still a lot of anxiety and, 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 and concerns in the community. UNM Athletic Director Eddie Nunez says the shooting wasn't the only reason for canceling. He cited past problems when playing in Las Cruces back in October during the rivalry football game. There were incidences that had occurred in the stands um, that were affecting our players. We had things thrown at our players. We had stuff stolen from our benches. That's the same game where a fight broke out. Police say the shooting in Albuquerque this weekend was an attempt at payback for that fight. But before the deadly shooting, Nunez says they were already looking into extra safety measures like adding metal detectors. He says expect them in the future. Yes, it might add a little bit, a second or two here to, to getting into the event, but it's the right thing to do right now. The AD also answered questions surrounding women's basketball player Brooke Barry. She posted on social media tonight that she is leaving the team due to concerns over gun violence. I want to wish Brooke the best opportunity wherever she decides to go. I would have loved to have seen her continue her education and her opportunity because I, I think she's a special uh, athlete. Um, but I understand and I, and I respect her decision. Now the decision to cancel the game is a costly decision. Nunez says it's coming at about a half a million dollar loss. Back to you. All right, thank you, Alexa. This will not affect the women's basketball schedule. They're still set to play in MSU here on December 11th.